hey people welcome to my channel and today i am going to show you how you can uh, write your own custom css code and put that code on your wordpress website by custom css and you can basically design anything which are showing here as you can see i have designed this uh, box shadow this box with border radius and here uh, the search box i have designed uh, i have designed the menu bar or the header of the site and of course i can design all the boxes with a background uh, box shadow like this one so it will look more beautiful so let's do it and if i do i have written the course here but if i refresh here you will see everything will be gone yeah as you can see everything is gone now everything is clear now it's looking good now but uh, this is what i did before but so it is not gonna going to go anywhere so if i open customize here let's let this guy load a little bit here and we can say like uh, we will try to design uh, design the search bar again with a background shadow because this is not looking clear in front of uh, in this page because we can only see the search but i i just want to make it more visible so for doing this i have to click the right button of my mouse and go inspect and click this one here this option here and i can hover on it so as long as you are hovering on this one you will find this one and here as, as i can see that this is the import search bar and if i go up this is the okay this is the form and if i go to the section okay this is a section made already so i want to edit this section and i i just click to section and here this is the html and this is the css so i i want to design it by my custom css so this is the field for me where i can write my custom code so let's get into it if i click uh, to write like uh, border i want to give it a border and press press enter I say one pixel solid as you can see already it, it has a border now but i don't want this border to be black i just want it to be white okay so the border is gone again because the everything is in this page is white so for viewing the border we can say like uh, box shadow which i like i really really like a lot and we can say one pixel one pixel one pixels and one pixels so as you can see something has changed here but it will not remain like this i want to change it for this one if we scroll up this is nothing happening here if we scroll down okay as you can see here this is the spreading so let's keep it like one and this is the blur one so it's looking good now let's go to five six seven let's keep it five and this one is the uh, vertical no this is horizontal one so we can put it like this one and this is the vertical one so it will go to the right more and more and if i click like uh, zero pixels here and and keep it seven and we can make it four five four here okay now as you can see here this is looking really really nice now so we can um, anyone here can see it like a card or you can do search here so but uh, if i re click refresh here this is not going to be saved for saving it i have to just copy the code i have written say copy and 
find the ID of this section. So this is the section and this is the ID called search file. So if I go to the page here, this is the customization here and click additional CSS. And this is the category uh, of box shadow here mm, for the categories. And let's ignore it and let's go two lines down and we have to put a hashtag for the ID. And the ID was something like search, uh, search 5, if I am right. Yeah, search 5. And I have to just press shift and second brackets. So it will give me two brackets and press enter. And we can paste the ID here. Uh, paste the um, custom CSS here. So if I scroll down, you will see that the uh, box has changed now so if i click ctrlz this is gone if i click ctrlv this is again here so if i click publish you will see that if i even refresh it this is not going to go anywhere okay so i have finally designed this one and now we can go for Mm. these guys are already fine with blue uh, borders up there but mm. we can design this one again with less border radius so we can say like three border radius so we have already here let's say border radius uh, let's just scroll down first as you can see here let's go border radius three and it's looking good if i say no border radius this is looking more good now but let's keep it like three three pixels so let's click publish okay so last thing i would like to do is i will try for um i will try for the box here uh, as you can see we have three box here we can do these boxes like this one so if i click inspect again and try to get this uh, let's get this one this one here as you can see this is the post content i need to click uh, click with the okay okay this is the article this is shown as article not as a section articles articles okay this is the article and if i search for the id this is post okay let's install this element here if i say let's install this element if i say like a border one pixel solid yeah this is happening as you can see but if i go down a little bit okay we want to design this one if i say border one pixel solid yeah this is also happening so you can say like uh, solid red and i just want to continue with this one because i have to test it first and the class was block post lay so let's go down here and say dot block post lay let's check it again block post lay and second brackets and let's say this one okay this is working as you can see uh, every border is red right now well so what we can do we can just edit from here now if i say uh, white nothing is going to change here and if i say again like box 
shadow mm, five pixels four pixels six pixels and minus three pixels wow this is looking good now so i want to make it uh, more visible so i can say like border radius and i can give it uh, three pixels what if seven pixels okay now three five pixel will be okay for these guys or let's keep it three and just publish it as you can see nothing is here but if i uh, refresh this everything will change here okay so now let's take a look wow this is not something looking really good cause uh, the, the lines are not the same so we should remove this one that was not a good idea okay so let's publish it again and they will be like okay and everything's fine so this is the method how you can um, edit anything or put your custom CSS on your WordPress website by idea by this additional css option so thank you for watching this video i hope